what was the result of the latest scan? It appears the Enclave troops have moved beyond the purifier into the surrounding wasteland region. No telling how far they went spread. I see. Hail. Hail to you, stranger. I am Squire Maxon, royal servant of steel. It is an honor to make your acquaintance. I plead for your pardon if my behavior offends, ma'am. We don't get many visitors in the Citadel. The brothers and elder lions are excellent teachers, but I get nervous about the protocols. The Codex says that outsiders are not to be trusted. Shield yourself from those not bound to you by steel, for they are the blind. Aid them when you can, but lose not sight of yourself, it says. It's not simply the outsiders that we are wary of. Anybody who has not taken the oath of fraternity is suspicious to us. The Codex says, Fear those who do not pledge to the Brotherhood, for though their eyes may be open through service, they are now blind. But it also tells us, Give way your suspicions to the wisdom of thine elder, where he shows trust, so shall you. Elder Lions trust you, so you are free to stay here. Oh, well, you see, I am descended from the great Roger Maxon, founder of our order. I am the last of his line. They say my soul was forged from eternal steel, but I don't believe that. I'm really just a normal boy. I was sent to the Citadel many years ago to be fostered by Elder Lions. But that was before the Western Elders lost I mean, faith in the Elder. I really don't know if I'll ever get home, but, well, I kind of like it here. Sentinel Lyant has been very kind to me. She's taught me so much. Oh, yes. I've studied them quite a bit since I've been here. They're not all the same, you know, besides the regular ones. There are also brutes. And after them, the Masters. They're really tough. But the worst of all? The Behemoth! He's a giant! I saw one once, outside the Citadel walls. So scary. The Super Mutants are all over the city ruins. But Elder Wine doesn't actually think they're from there, or we would have found their home by now. It kind of seems like they're looking for something, but we're not really sure what that is. No. But I could. I know I'm ready. I mean, it would be scary, but it's not fair that I have to sit inside while the knights go on patrol. I did go out one time, you know. Sarah, uh, Sentinel Lions took me out, just to show me. I killed a super mutant too, I swear. I, uh, I also sort of shot Sarah, but just a little. It was just a flesh wound. May we speak again soon. Hail. Step lively, Squire. So, what's the latest Hail. report? Hail. Super mutant activity in DC is high. launchers. My recommendation? Headshot from a distance. Avoid the meat grinder. We're the most elite tactical unit ever assembled in the Brotherhood of Steel. Here or anywhere else. Hell, ain't nothing Sarah's Cubs can't handle. I'm a sniper with the pride. Put any mutie bastard within one mile of me and my rifle and, well, Pack it up, troops. Fight's over. Colvin thinks he's a better shot. Man's delusional. Stay
Dig to the shadows. Good to see you. Turns out they die rather frequently. More so than us, which uh, works in our favor. Shoot them, they die. Stab them, they die. Strangle them, they die. Sarah appreciates my methods. I fill a role no one else can. Spec Ops. Let's leave it at that. Who are soldier? Stay straight. Once again. Clear here. What do you mean? As long as we keep grinding, we'll be through them in no time. We just need to keep the pressure on them. Now that's a story. The only reason I'm here is because of Elder Lions. You see, I grew up in the pit. Don't suppose you ever been there, huh? It's about 500 clicks to the northwest. Place a nightmare. Three irradiated rivers coming together. People there were... not well. But the Brotherhood of Steel came down on the place with a righteous hand. They called it the Scourge. It was a Brotherhood operation. They marched in and swept the place clean. Most of the people there were half-mutated, cancerous, vile things. This was way back, before the Citadel was fortified. Part of the early recon after the Brotherhood first arrived in this area. One night, a squad of brothers led by Paladin Lions swept into the city from over Mount Wash, tearing apart anyone who stood against them. They were completely outnumbered, and still they raised that place to the ground. As they swept through, the Brotherhood policed up every non muty child they could find. Turns out there weren't that many. Me and maybe 20 others. The younger we were, the less of a chance that we were mutated. It was ugly work, no doubt, but it had to be done. I'll never forget the sight of the Brotherhood of Steel breaching the breast of the mountain at dawn. Elder Lyons brought us all back to the Citadel. He said it was the safest place he knew of. This place was still being converted. He put us in as initiates and kept a watchful eye over us. He was tough, but he taught us to stay alive. The man is like a father to me. Nah, the amazing thing is Elder Lyons. He risked everything. Went in outmanned and outgunned. I'll never be able to thank him enough. So I do my best to serve the Brotherhood. I know that that's what he really wants. In time, I'm sure you'll understand. Hell, I've killed more of those yellow Frankensteins than any other member of the Pride. Except maybe Gallows, those crazy solo night ops of his. Now I see the Brotherhood's one thing, but the Pride, best of the best. Every damn one of us. Handpicked by Sentinel Lions herself. Hell, I do it all. Recon, demolition, tactical assault. Guess you could say I'm the Pride's jack of all trades. Strength and steel, friend. So, uh. Yes? Yeah. I've overheard some things. The offensive is going well. What do you think we could keep the 
pressure on them. Look, we've won every engagement we've been in so far. We got that robot on our side. Everything will be fine. We've made it this far, right? We'll get through this. Spend some time on target practice in the Bailey. That'll get the jitters out. Roger that. Good to see you in one piece, partner. What can I do for you? Hey. Hail. Need can I be of assistance? Ah, one of my favorite subjects, of course. What would you like to know? We believe in technology, in the triumph of the creations of the ancients over the horrors and evils of the wasteland. We believe in trust. Trust in technology. Trust in our fellow brothers. Trust in our elders. Ah, and we believe in victory. Our forces have dwindled, but still we fight on. Super mutant, enclave. It matters not. Surrender is not an option. Elder Lyons leads us. Star Paladin Cross is a Seneschal. Sentinel Lyons, the Elder's daughter, commands the Lion's Pride, our elite combat squad. The Paladins lead the Knights. The Knights are the core of the Brotherhood. They scour the waste to eliminate evil and recover technology. Scribe Rothschild oversees the scribes in their duties to seek knowledge and restore the technology the Brotherhood has acquired. We first arrived in the Capital Wasteland in 2255. In those first couple of years, we discovered the Citadel, Super Mutants, and Project Purity. Ah, the Purifier. What an undertaking. The work your father and his team did was amazing. The Brotherhood helped protect them, you know, at least for a little while. But we were stretched thin as it was, even back then. We had to pull our forces out. When we did, the place was overrun. I imagine that's when your father left. I... I'm sorry. I wish things had turned out differently. Very well. You have... if you have... Good. As I'm sh we're short on... Sh As I told you, with the increase in super mutant activity and Elder Lion's edicts regarding our goals, we are critically short on manpower. Any soldier that I would ask to do this task is one less soldier fighting in the field or defending the Citadel. As much as I hate to involve outsiders, it is necessary if I am to properly maintain the scrolls to honor the dead. They are on our fallen brothers throughout the DC ruins. However, I can't give you a full report on the locations of all of our operations. As I said, many of the units in the field operate independently sometimes not reporting into the Citadel for weeks or months. My thoughts haven't changed. They're still not worthy of discussion. Hopefully before long, we won't have to think about them at all. Well, there are a number of orders within the scribes, each dedicated to a specific area of research. The Order of the Sword is responsible for weapons research and development. Guns, ammunition, anything of an offensive nature. Defensive research is done by the Order of the Shield power armor, defensive structures, anything that is intended to protect us. 
the Order of the Quill preserves the written knowledge of the ancients, seeking out all manner of books and holotapes. Actually, I am Proctor of the Order of the Quill. I oversee the archives and library here in the Citadel. We are dedicated to preserving the history of the Brotherhood, as well as unearthing the secrets of the pre-war civilizations. We have a single field associate, Scribe Yearly. She operates out of the former Library of Congress to the Northeast. Let me know if you need something else. The Brotherhood has been battling super mutants for decades. First out west, then in Chicago, now here. But this group of super mutants is different somehow. Physically, yes, but mentally as well. If we knew where they came from, we'd know why. Go with peace and knowledge. What do you need? Talk to Scribe. You honor us with your presence here. Did you need something? I hope you're... Yeah.
A pleasure doing business with You saved my life. Thank you. You... I can just have it? Really? Great. Another water beggar. If you're here looking for water, I'm afraid I can't help you. All the water is at Project Purity. If you want a handout, head over to the Jefferson Memorial and ask for Scribe Bigsley. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm busy coordinating military operations. Hmm. I've heard about you. I suppose you can handle yourself out there. And I am down to my greenest boys. All right. But it's no cakewalk. I got to get these caravans full of water to the farthest reaches of the wasteland. I'm running out of resources, and attacks have increased. I suspect something organized is going on. Great. I can really use a strong arm on this one. I need you to escort a caravan from Project Purity to Canterbury Commons. If, or rather when, they get ambushed, I need you to figure out who's behind the attack. After protecting the caravan, track down the attacker's base of operations and put an end to it once and for all. If you aren't woman enough for the job, fine. I don't want you. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have operations to conduct. Hey, back off. I'm not looking for any trouble. Back off. I'm not looking for any back trouble. Back off. I'm not looking for any trouble. Once we exhaust the supply of free beer, then we'll get going. there.
by raiders, or, or was it mutants? They want additional compensation for losses and unexpected expenditures. It's the goddamn wasteland. What the hell did they expect? I don't know, sir. Should I tell them to go away? I wish, but no. I need them. They're some of the few that bothered to come back at all. A hearty bunch, this group. Almost as good as our own men. I see. Well, what should I do with them about their demands for compensation? Did anyone die? I don't think so, no. Oh, that's good. Some bottle caps, then? How much is left in the petty cash box? They want plasma weapons. What? They saw an initiate lugging a crate to the armory. Fucking hell! Sir? Those weapons were to go to Rivet City, but you know, whatever, a, a rifle, grenade or two, but only if they agree to take a shipment immediately to Big Town. Yes, sir. What kind of name is Big Town, anyway? I don't know, sir. Go on. Don't keep our guests waiting any longer. I have work to do. Yes, sir? <sighs> I think I caught the boss napping at his desk again. Tell me something. Yes? Look, I'm busy. Hey, since Dr. Lee left, we've all had so much more to do. Who knew she did so much? <laughs> 